to go ahead and present this award to you and a check for $500 for your organization. And if you would just say a couple of words. Well, obviously I'm very, very honored and I don't know how many of you know, but I was a teacher in Oceanside for many years and had students that knew very little about their community, knew very little about the United States, knew nothing about the world, and discovered that if I connected my students with other youth around the world, it changed their lives. And um, got this vision of a global schoolhouse, this is pre-internet, if you can remember there was pre-internet, where kids could solve problems together, learn from one another, learn with one another, and the last 20 years have just been an amazing experience for me. I've met so many incredible um, people from around the world that share this vision, and it's very optimistic. It's quite a different vision than you get to see when you watch TV and listen to the news and read the newspaper. There is an amazing um, <clears throat> network of people that are committed to guiding youth to solve problems, work together, collaborate, and uh, recently I discovered a book that I'm going to recommend. It's called Wikonomics. It's by a, an author named Donald Tapscott, and it's all about how math collaboration is going to accelerate learning and business and uh, medical advances, and as we begin to work together, collaborate together, and, and learn together, it's just going to be a whole different world. I want to thank all my friends and family members and these two tables here. When I'm not um, doing global schoolhouse type activities, you can find me on the tennis court, and so a lot of my friends are tennis network people, but uh, we hardly ever see each other in real clothes, so this is kind of a treat. So um, thank you so much, and thank you to my friend Barbara, who nominated me. I, she was one of the first people that I met when I went to school, when I went to teach in Oceanside. I was a substitute teacher, and actually substituted for her for, for a while, but didn't get to meet her because she was never there, because I was subbing for her. But anyway, I've known her for, for, uh, for more than 20 years, and also at my table, um, Ollie Spiro, who is on the board of directors of the School of Business and Technology, and we have a little office there uh, trying to work with the Oceanside schools and, and help uh, um, motivate the students to be good global citizens. So, thank you all. Thank you so much.